I understand that yesterday the governor was with you, which uh, should have been pretty funny all within itself. We got an old fellow that lives down around Pearl River, Louisiana. I live up in Picayune, Mississippi, and we got an old fellow that lives down there named Joe Wilkinson. And Joe is a kind of a terror of the road. He drives a 1950 Studebaker pickup truck, which uh, he's had ever since the day it was, it was manufactured. And he runs back and forth between Pearl River and Slidell and Poplarville. And I don't think Joe knows that that truck will go under 70 miles an hour, even backing out of his driveway. And most of the troopers along that area are fairly familiar with him, and they kind of turn their head when he comes by because he not only is he a lovable old character, but he has never caused a wreck, nor has he ever been involved with one. But about six weeks ago, we got a new trooper assigned to our area there, and, and uh, Joe came by. He was, uh, this trooper decided that he was going to station himself at the Pearl River turnaround and get him one of them speeders. And he'd been there about 10 minutes when Joe Wilkinson came by doing about 90 miles an hour in that old 1950 Studebaker truck. Trash blowing out of the back end of it, fenders flapping in the breeze, love bugs smeared all over the front of it. He was hooking it right on up toward Poplarville. And that trooper seen him and he come flying out of that turnaround, had them blinking bubblegum machine lights on and blowing his siren and... Joe ain't never seen anything like that before, and he just kind of pulled over in the right-hand lane to give this fella room to get by. And that trooper come up beside him and was waving him to get over to the side of the road, and Joe had never seen him before, and he thought he was just saying hello, and he waved at him and showered down on that old Studebaker and blew out a puff of smoke and was blasting it up the road. Left that trooper sitting there. So he poured the coal to it and pulled out his gun and came up beside him and was waving that gun, telling him to get over on the side of the road. And Joe slammed on his brakes and pulled over, and that trooper pulled up in front of him, and old man Wilkinson jumped out of that truck and went running up there and said, Feller, what's the matter? Said, what can I do to help you? And that trooper come boiling out of that truck, had his hat on and that big gun in his hand. He looked at him. He said, old man, damn, ain't you got a governor on that truck? And old Joe looked at him and said, a what? And he said, a governor, a governor. And Joe said, no. Said, the governor's at the Capitol building in Baton Rouge. That's fertilizer and hog slop you smell back there. 